good one, buddy. <laughs> that big one, nasty, bro. Bring the camera to me, geez, because I'm gonna make a very, very important phone call. <laughs> I'm buzzing, right? So I just had a phone call from an agent, um, Redwood and Sons in Bognor Regis. Little plug out, because this geezer. Barnum. Huh? Barnum. Barnum in Barnum. Redwood and Sons in Barnum, estate agents, right? I found a house. We've done it on camera recently, and I found a property that I really wanted. Put an offer in, and we didn't know if we were gonna get it because there was three, two other people going up for it. And um, we went below the asking price because that's all we could afford, right? So we've gone in anyway, I just had a phone call and we've got the house, bro. The man's give it to us, we've got the house. We've pictured it in our head over and over again exactly how we, we sort of bigged ourselves up to yeah, have this house. It, yeah. And if it didn't happen and the man said, no, I'd have been, I'd have cried, I reckon, I'd have been gutted. But I'm gonna basically ring her up and pretend that we haven't got the house. Hello, can we get you back? All right, sorry, I didn't mean to call you. I've just come up the phone to um, Simon from the estate agents. Mm -hmm. it, it ain't great, to be honest. Basically, they had two people look at it over the weekend, and one of them's offered the asking price, and they're in a very good position to go. So, basically, what he said is that the seller wants to go with the, the more money on it. And he's tried his hardest for us to get it for us as well. He's done everything he could to make it happen. But he said, look, unfortunately, he said, look, you've missed out on this one. But he keep us on his database and hopefully try and find something similar. Alrighty. Bollocks, isn't it? Yep. How do you feel about that? I feel that you're lying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. We've got it. We've got it, girl. It's ours. Yeah, it's ours, yeah. <laughs> you could do a I played football yesterday. Right. I scored a weldy. Literally, top left bins, mate. Literally, even my mate messaged me, I showed you this morning, Sam, what a weldy. Yeah, so anyway, but we lost 6-4, and we led three times in the game. But that don't matter, because I scored bottoms up. You didn't show me any text, mate. I did show you the text, no, you I didn't. did. Basically, do you want me to describe the goal? So I basically skip. Need a cup of coffee after that. And I've got to sit down now and prep because we've got three meetings. One, half one, and two o'clock. We're meeting with, we've got a meeting with Brady people. We've got a meeting with a plastering machine company. They, they, they manufacture a plastering machine, spray, spray machines. Because they watched one of our videos when we went out with Chris, Power Plastering, Bob and Friends. And we've got a meeting with Vanguard. This is a good meeting as well, because I want to know about kitting out these pride vans with a whole van system kit, and also ball builders and friends. Because we've got a feature that we do in ball builders friends where we do van check. And every van that we've seen so far, it's painful for me to say, they are disgusting. If their van, if their house is anything like their van, I wouldn't even have a cup of tea. So I feel like it's our duty as the ball builders, didn't you Sam, to get involved and hopefully be able to kit out our friends yes. with a new van system yeah, yeah, to yeah. jazz up their van to give them a better way of working. Some of them are bad. Job. <laughs> Bang! <laughs> How's that go off? I don't know. It's too much air in it. Do you reckon? No, Ethan didn't even fill it up that much. I have to go around every other day, Ethan, and do this because I'm the only one that does it. Can you use Brad's phone to film? <laughs> I have a video idea. Oh yeah, I watched a badminton thing the other day, yeah? Yeah. Playing badminton and it come over and the man faked it and as he faked it, he pulled his arm around his back and whacked it over the net. And that was his trick shot, he'd done it about four times in a row. He faked it and pulled it around, bosh! I mean, look. What do you reckon? Would that look good? I think that looked absolutely <laughs> stunning. <laughs> so you, I'll start filling it up. <laughs> then I'll stop it there. Then you've got to put it back on and fill it up. Oh, and it pops on the person? Yeah, whoever it pops So it's on. passing it over? Yes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> like this. Good catch, right? Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. This might not work then. The game might not work. We will, we just got to pass it to each other and Quickly. then put it back on. All right. It would work. Yeah? Give it a go. <laughs> Like that, and then, yeah. I don't even know if it went up. I don't know if it did. I pressed down there, I don't know if it much went in there. 
That's so scary! How did he not move? That has got bigger. <laughs> He's gonna go yeah, back. Is that a watering cup one, isn't it? That's moved a little bit. It didn't move much though. But it did move a bit. It's like a light bulb. No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> He's scary. Yeah, because I'm trying to do it and, and hold the camera as well. <laughs> That's a good game! Oh. We need a leaderboard up here for this game with our new prop. Oh my god. Jinx. You think these blues That's it. That's it. That that 800 one. Yeah, lit for 100 and something, and then 100 and something. Yeah, that's two different orders. One was the hot chocolate, and one was the. This is cool. Nice. You can't not touch me, can you? Yeah. See, let's, let's, let's. So, would you like to ask? Um, I'm really pleased that I'm moving in with Rhea and Brad. No, you're not. How nice is no, that? No, that more than. Have you um, have you sorted your uh, van out for your bed? No. Oh, you haven't. You haven't yet. Yeah. Oh, come on. Day off without you in my ears. What about bed? I'm looking to get a single Listen, bed. Listen, he asked. He's been oh. asking about a single bed, and I nicely, I've got him a really nice single bed. But yeah. oh, we haven't got a van that it fits. And he can't. In. He can't go around and get it. Congrats on your house, Ree. That's why I've come here to see my my baby. But, but we've got to deal with the bank now. I know. And we've got to rate throughout. So we've got our, like everyone's going for at the moment. The mortgage lenders are pulling rates, and they pulled the rate on us and we don't know what the new rate's gonna be until tomorrow. I'm gonna to be surprised tomorrow. So we, we, we know we're paying more, <laughs> but it's how much more and making sure that it's affordable how much more. I blow balloons up, we're trying to fill the van up at the moment with balloons. Huh? He's drumming. <laughs> oh, he's drumming. He's drumming. Mention got... work to my son and he shits it. Mention it to my no, daughter and she's like, no problem, I'll do it. Anyway, early night tonight, you've got an early start tomorrow. With me. Why are you well, Oi, you don't need to me. remind me? You with don't need me. to remind me. I'm, 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 I'm old. I can't Every wait time to work she gets with you. <laughs> with me. I can't wait to work with you. I'm in the kitchen. I'm yeah. in the kitchen yeah. for the next yeah. three days. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't need to remind me. I have to be there early. You look like the conductor there. <laughs> Hugh Jackman. She looks like Hugh Jackman at a great show run. I like it. Well, Hey, he just someone. Oh, Adam just called me Miss Butlins and he called me Miss Butlins. Hey, red coat, <laughs> I've got man food, feeling it. Uh, I need some strepsils, really, some nose spray. Uh, but I'm here, you know what I mean, Eve? I'm still here, I'm grinding, I'm here every day, still doing the radio. I need to rest the voice. I feel like a bit like, you know, the singers on X Factor, and then they get to judges' houses, and then they're like, oh. I don't know if I can go on my front 13. I reckon that's me. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> you have a lot of likability, Sam, because you're very open and you look good. So he, he could have done all these dishes he's doing this Friday and we're going to do it with something he's going to bring down. But that would have been perfect. He could have done it on one of your barbecues, for example. Same with the numbers. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's it landed on? Six. Come on, bro! Come on, the man! Oh, mate! The man, the myth, the legend! Man's on the spin up! <laughs> go in there, alright, let's go. Right, we are here. These are the last few balloons. Loads of pop. You need to smash them in. The van is stacked up with yellow and black balloons. How many balloons are in the back of this short wheelbase, full transit, custom van, which is available to win over the builders' place.com. Only 62 pounds, <laughs> 50 a ticket. But better still, there is only 990. Hey, Where are we going, Sam? We are off to the kitchen, because Brad is working in the kitchen today, because James is in Amsterdam. His old mate Junior is coming down, you know Junior, don't you? Big Junior. Big Junior. I've never met him, so we thought we'd go down and go and see him. Oh, they're putting... Um... Isn't it mad that you can't get a sign outside? Yeah, everyone else can. Oh, there's Teddy shouting abuse at me, as always. What up? Violence. What's happening, mate? Hello, mate. So I'm behind the junk today, doing a little bit of cooking. Ooh. We're getting right busy. <laughs> Smash out a lot of burgers, and I've got how many cooking videos we're we doing as well? Six. Five or six cooking videos. Excuse me, sir. Could you in the car please holidays? drop me up some bits of chicken for um, chicken, chicken and bacon? bacon. Uh, there's none. There's none there. Come on. Show me where everything is. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Calvin. Let's go. While we're here, Eve. You smell nice. Cool. You got any Washing powders out. Nah, these are old, bro. <laughs> That's not normal, is it? That's strange. I just want to do a little something because everyone gets confused when they come to the kitchen as to how either one to use the drive through or two, basically how it works. So, let's do a little walk through. Right, Kev. This is where you enter the kitchen. Well, the car park. Drive here, off of the main road. You drive here. You now have two options. Option A. <laughs> option A, you park your car and you walk through these lovely gates into the kitchen where there's seating area. Or option B, imagine we're in a car now. Drive, 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 drive. Beep, beep. Now we're at the drive through Obviously you'd be in a car, so you wouldn't have to walk through. Then you come to this window. This is where you order, and this is where you get your food from. Coffee, Breakfast sticks, burgers, we sell hot food and cold food through, through the drive through as well. So if you can't be bothered to get out of your car, drive through the drive through Because people park up and walk to the window and they think that the window is where we serve from. But it's not, because if you follow me, I'll show you where you actually order from. Okay. You eat, sit, there's about 60 seats. Order at the hatch, and then you can sit here and eat your grub. Oh, yeah, yeah, there you go. I couldn't see that. <laughs> Is it like that? No attention to DL, no F's given. That is it's just lazy. It's a nice boy. He's <laughs> such a nice character. Eyes on him. He's looking in the window now. Stephen. Name's Stephen. He's got a bike. That bike. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. 
We don't go out now. I watch all the time. Oh, thank you, mate. Appreciate yeah, that, mate. Yeah, it's really good. Have a good one, brother. Say hello to Brad as well. Yeah, I will do, mate. Okay. See you, mate. Cheers, mate. One. One hundred and fifty-two. One hundred and fifty-two. One hundred and fifty-four. One hundred fifty-six. One hundred fifty-seven. Oh, thousand comments. Someone's got to have had two, four, eight on the original video that we posted. Two, six, three. Two, four, seven. Oh. That's the closest. Yeah. That is the ah! oh. <laughs> Come on, mate. This was a bad idea. It's a lot of 250s. Ah, what's going on? Two, four, eight. Are you the lucky winner? Two, four, three. Oh, it looked like oh, it then, didn't it? Getting closer. Two, four, eight is the number. 248 was the winner. We're just trying to find... Two, four, eight! Hey, Steve Newbury! Steve Newbury! Steve Newbury, you are the winner! Two, four, eight! Steve Newbury! He's My there, man. Mr. Steve Newbury. You are the winner, son. I'm gonna send you a message. To thebuildersprize.com, you can enter and win that van. Steve, I'm going to send you a code um, or a, a load your account up so you can win your free ticket to enter the van. 248 balloons. We've got to pop all of these now. <laughs> one hour later. Honestly, it's, it definitely is one of them weeks. Or, um, I'll be honest, <laughs> I've lost the plot already. It's only Wednesday. Um, oh, yeah, God. well, you know what I was calling for anyway, because I've already called you. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Thebuildersprize.com. I'm ringing every single person to make sure they've got their ticket, make sure they're happy, um, and basically just get in touch with them, because customer service is king. The only problem is they sometimes they think that they've won. So then I have to like back. <laughs> and I'm like, the other one. I'm just. Is that Matthew? Speaking. Matthew is Sam from Ball Builders. How you doing, mate? Hey. You alright? Yeah, I am, yeah. <laughs> Good. Uh, it was just a quick call, mate, to make sure you got your ticket number through via email. Yeah, I think I have, yeah. Okay, mate. No worries. Yeah, it was just I a. <laughs> I was just, I was just saying that I've literally rang everyone that's entered, and every single person has said the same thing. The mannequin challenge. That was good, isn't it? Yeah, that was really good, mate. We've got boxes everywhere. <laughs> These are all from Hamilton. We've got loads of them. Loads of them, yeah, there's, there should be... 10? 10. So basically, every time we go out and see one of our friends, we're ball builders of friends, we're gonna give them a nice freebie. Sometimes you gotta sit back at Eve, innit? Like, I did that yesterday, yeah, and, I, and, and, and it helped. Day before yesterday, it helped, right? Because sometimes when you're running business and you're so busy, you forget to yeah. sit down and think. Do you know what? We done it. We was up here and I was like, we need to get out of it. Yeah. So we just took a drive down to the same trees and then we come up with new ideas. Yeah. Didn't it? As simple as that. That's Five a word for my right. book. You said drove, not drive. Took a drove. So that's a word for my forums. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's I've got a brand of forums coming on, so I like drove, took a drove. We're getting ready because I'm about to move this van out here because we're going to do a video. How many arm curls can I do within one hour, non-stop? So I'm going to set that up there. You're going to film it for a separate video. How many of them can I do within an hour before my arm just says no? What's your guess? In an hour? 60 oh. minutes. <laughs> 60 minutes, 60 seconds. I pressed the drill by accident. What you saying, Sam? What I'm going to do? You good? Tell me a little bit, mate. Oh, you saying you're doing, bro? Yeah, I'm fine, yeah? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, that's one of the prizes. No way. Yeah, that's going. 
a surprise, all these are prizes. Jeez. Love, that radio studio's upstairs. Nice. And then the editing suite's up there, and then this is where we do the cooking videos and... Oh, beauty. Yeah, so we have a little set up and we just make shit. I had that in the back of the van the other day. Oh, so you're talking about, that's what I'm cooking on? Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. man. <laughs> you, you said to me, you said to me, I, like I just that. need a flame. I was like, all right, all right, all right, all right. I need a flame, bro. Let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> you got barbecue, yeah? Yeah, there, look. That's it. <laughs> you got a kill at me. Nah, that's going to be beautiful, man. We can make it work. We can make it work. <laughs> <laughs> that red one, it hurt in my thumb. Thank you. Thank you very much. That red one's nasty, bro. <laughs> I won't lie, I did just have one. Mm. My mouth went a bit numb. Oh, that red one nasty, bro. Just prepared. Yeah, you got to bring your rubber with you. I brought everything but the kitchen sink. <laughs> right, yeah, guys, we're here with Chris today from Power Plastery. He's not only a good plasterer, but he's quite a good cook as well. So he's come down today and he's our new resident chef. Resident chef? Resident chef, is that the word? <laughs> oh, I'm resident, I'll yeah. Like I'll, like I'll take that, I'll take that all day long. But guys, thank you for inviting me down. And you know what, from the last video we did and stuff, um, you guys said, oh look, we're gonna invite you down to the kitchen, but I thought it was talk. And next thing, a week later, I'm down here cooking and all sorts of stuff. We, so, we did promise you a kitchen, but this is all you got. You know what, we'll work with it, we'll yeah. work with it. Yes. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, guys. This is going to change the painting industry forever. I can't do this. There's, there's four of you there, bro. Adam, bro. Come on. I'm cameraing. I'm doing I the camera skills. I see what would happen. <laughs> I made the thing. What was that phrase? You're, you're cameraing. I'm cameraing. <laughs> you're cameraing. I'm cameraing too. more. <laughs> feel this, that, that feels like yogurt. Guys. There we go. <laughs> that ain't gonna go through, bro. <laughs> Sam, you really ain't thought about this Put video. Put some water in it. No, but I mean, what, what's this whole... Oh, basically, we have glued the lid into here, and then we're gonna screw it on. So then as you paint, the paint comes through the brush. Theory. Not practical. Really up to you. I'm sure it'll get eaten, I mean. We've got prawns and stuff anyway. We've got lobster tail as well. Do you know about lobster tail? Woo! I thought the barbecue was supposed to be here. I thought you were going to give you a, a lovely lobster tail on the barbecue, all golden and oh my days, heaven. We've got our garlic. Oh yeah. No, we've got our scotch bonnet peppers. Now this ain't going to agree with Sam at all. That's going to make the seasoning stick to the meat. Yeah. Nice. Beauty. Now the, this is a gold dust. You, if you can find this, you're doing well. This is Portland rub. This is what I use. And we're gonna sprinkle that on there like that. And that's got a lot of chili powder, well, chili peppers and all that sort of stuff on it and what have you. That's my seasons. And that is how you, you create yourself a super duper. Actually, I might speak to Hamilton and see if they wanna sort of pattern this. Yeah. Because this could be an idea that I work if with we, Hamilton. If we got that right, I think we'll be all right. Cutting was off because we had and the, the wrong drill bit. And the paint. And the paint's a little bit off, so that's ruined it. But if you had the right product... The theory's here, look. look the, put it into practical. Yes, look. And it's this is a uh, prototype. I feel like I'm like like a car sprayer at the moment. Yeah. Do you know, well, like, that's like a spray gun. Do. That's all that is, is a spray gun. Drill through there. It ain't a bad idea that it's coming down there, you know. Nah, that is, because it's messy. You don't want it oh, messy. Yeah, look, you want it clean like yeah, that. Look how true, clean yeah. that side is there. The idea being is if it was cleaner, it would be brilliant. And I reckon if you manufactured this in properly. properly, straight away with a proper fitting top, I think we're onto something. I think you could do it, and then all you've got to do is unscrew that, change it, and you can have all the colours lined up if you're doing different. Do you know what I mean? No, because you steal the brush, you still have that paint. But look, that's it. So then just work along, and then it's very easy to attach again. Just screw it back on. Job done. Job done. Off we go again. We're back. We're back cooking with gas, as they say. Let us know in the comments what we should call this. Yes. I think, it's, a great, it's a great idea, yeah. So I've taken my time putting it in. Trying not to cook. 
Man or a barbecue man? Barbecue. Barbecue. Woo! Barbecue. Yeah, well, this barbecue is quite nice. This is a what's it called? Sun tropical sun. I tell you what you do. You take the plate. I'm gonna need <laughs> okay, it. That's your plate, mate. Ethan, you're up next, mate. That is fine with me, Chris. Lovely. Here we go. Going in Thank there, you. Mate. Yeah. Cool. Oh, that's got some kick as well. Is it hot? Oh, that's nice though. I'm sorry, brother. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, mate. <laughs> no, it's nice, man. <laughs> Pardo bread was originally uh, taken from the Chinese that actually came to Jamaica, set up businesses, and they came with their own cuisines, and then they brought over the hardo bread, and then it just developed into a Jamaican hardo bread. And it's hard on the outside, and it's so soft and sweet on the inside. Mm -hmm. On the page, we're looking for a mixture because otherwise it, it gets boring the same person all of the time, all of the time doing the same stuff, isn't it? Yeah. So having Chris now coming in doing some content, grow the page, and then Chris will recommend us to one of your pals or yeah. someone else who can cook. Right. Grow it, grow it, and I want to build a community around it. That's what the idea is. Yeah. Blowing it up. Family and yeah. cooking. That's what tying in family, cooking. Exactly that is. Yeah. You got the quick meals, the long meals. There's so many variances you can yeah. do. You you really got a good yeah. platform to start off. Oh, with. Oh. It's so it's soft. Like a big bun, isn't it? It's like a big bun, and it's sweet as well. So imagine now you've got the sweet bread, the jerk prawns on top of the bread. Oh, mate! <laughs> I get excited myself. Right, let's check that. It ain't very sharp. <laughs> Mate, it's like using a spoon. Do you know about this old technique about uh, sharpening knives with the knife? No. My mum showed me the other day. Basically, she did it like this, and she sharpened the knife with a knife. And I was like, no, it don't work. And then when I cut something, it was sharp as <laughs> I ever got it. I couldn't get it as sharp as she did it. I'll give, give that a go anyway. Oh, yeah, it did sharpen it. Ethan, have a taste of that bread, mate. Have a taste of that bread. Oh, I'll get your chops on that, mate. Good. Ooh, that's soft. <laughs> it's, it's soft, isn't it? It's not a dessert. It's like, you're right, it's crazy, isn't it? It's called hardo bread. That's sweet. Sweet, nice. Mmm. Because it's done with a sharper knife. That's our hardo bread all cut up and lovely. Thank you, Cornfield. There is going to be our medium heat, and this is designed for Sam and Brad over in the corner. But this is doing well. It's only a few minutes, guys. It's not much. This is like quick street food. It's not supposed to take an hour, two hours. It's supposed to take you half an hour at most. And then you're supposed to be eating and enjoying it. Look at that. Take our time. Bearing gifts. Right. So I've got you a few gifts. Nice. What's that? Look. This is the Straight Ease clip-on system that you clip onto plasterboard, yeah, timber. Yeah. It's quite good for dusting down things up there. <laughs> I'll give you that, mate. That's your patties. Oh, <laughs> you, you, you don't got... know, bro. I've been mean, waiting a long time for <laughs> you, right? Yeah. No. Yeah, no way. <laughs> no, I will. And you've got beef. They're from Patty Palace. The beef, chicken, right. vegetables, and lamb. You've got two of each. This is for bread. This is one of the old needle trails. Oh! It's a transparent one as well. He's gonna yeah. love that. Oh. I don't know if you've ever seen one, you can see straight through. That's it's beautiful. Bro. And it's actually a real trail. You can you, you use yeah, it yeah. day to day. That's that's part of the clippy system, they're the clips for it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. Oh, and then the boy. <laughs> and I've got you some, yeah, mate, I stayed up. I, I got up at two o'clock <laughs> and I made these hats into the morning and then came straight here. Sharp. I'm telling you, these are some Yaga hats for you guys. No. Thank you very yeah. much. <laughs> oh, you've got your own printer. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You don't mess about. And Ethan, this is for you, mate. This is an orb for filming. So you actually put it in front of your no. lens. And you can film some you know, eyeball effects and stuff like that. No. Some different 
do a YouTube video on the orbs. They're pretty yeah. good, yeah. Ah, oh, <laughs> sick! Yeah, I've got one myself, but I've, I've never used it yet, so. Like, yeah, that's I ordered cool. you one, mate. Oh, nice one, brother. That's the gifts I've got for you guys. Yeah, for life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Real doing, real things. Thank you for the uh, invite, guys. It's wonderful to see you. Mate, thank you for coming down. Wow, I need some. You look. I need some. That's the best quality. No, but no. Actually, it's fine. That's good, isn't it? You don't look like that. Yeah, you look like that. Yeah, you look like that.